Hi guys, Nicole here. I'm from the Backers Bonus Review team. Today we're going to talk about Page Builder Pro, what it is, how it works, and how we think the product can help you. Alright, so Page Builder Pro, as the name suggests, is a cloud-based software that allows you to easily create pages without any coding skills or any of those technical stuff. This is great if you are just starting out or if you want to save on designer costs. And if you purchase with commercial license, this will also allow you to sell websites to clients. Now let's go ahead and take a quick look of the tool. Alright, so once you're logged in, you're then prompted to choose from the available templates in the selection. As you can see, they have a wide range of options that you can choose from. They have generic templates that you can use for basic pages such as affiliate pages, bonus pages, your blog pages, pages from your website, your membership site, and for all other purposes that you can think of. And aside from that, they have also categorized some of the templates based on niche. So if you plan to purchase a commercial license and use this for business, it would be easier for you to create these websites because they have already been categorized based on niche. All right. So aside from choosing from the pre-built templates that are available in the software, you can also create a website from scratch by choosing this option, empty project. Okay, but let's just say that you are going back to work on a project that you've already previously worked on within the software. So all you have to do is to close the screen out, go to files, and click on open saved website. It should then take you to a list of projects that you've already worked on and saved within the software. So if you want to go back to this particular project, you just need to hover to the right and click on open. It will then take you to the editor where you can continue working on the website page. But for this video, let's just say that we are going to start on a new project. So going back, if you want to start a new project, again, you can choose from the pre-built templates that is available, or you can also start from scratch by choosing empty project. All right, so let's just say we plan to use this template here so you have to click on it and click select it should then take you to the editor page which will allow you to customize every single element that is available on a page everything is fully customizable and at the same time you can also add in new elements from the left side panel so this is how the editor looks like it's it looks simple it has the available menu options at the top and to add a new element you just need to hover to the left and click on the category all right so before we start adding in other elements let's work on the uh, page itself so as i mentioned earlier everything is customizable so you just need to click on the element you can either move it around get the embed code you can duplicate the element you can delete the block or you can resize it or add in a customized size for the margin and padding then click on set all right so again everything is fully customizable you can change the images for text you just need to click on it and you'll be able to edit the text in any way that you want all right All right, so let's just say that you would like to add in some more elements to complete the project that you're working on. All you need to do is to hover to the left. The editor or the software itself actually includes a huge selection of elements that you can choose from. So all you have to do is to uh, select the type of element that you would like to add and choose from the available designs. So. Again, there are a lot of elements that you can choose from, from header, titles, subtitles, a button, a call to action, a profile, social media buttons, everything, everything that you can think of is here. All right, so let's just say that you would like to add in a, um, a button on this section of the page. So everything is drag and drop. So you just need to choose a design and add it 
on the page. All right, so again, you can edit the buttons or edit the element any way you like, change the text, you can increase the size, change the margin, you can add in the links where the buttons would be redirected to. So there are a lot of possible things that you can do with the um, elements that you've added in. All right, so let's just say aside from that, you would like to, um, so um, let's just say you want to add in some more images or a gallery of photos into your website. So um, all you have to do is to look for that element Choose a design and drag it on that section. So everything again is fully customizable. So you just need to add in the page, the link, um, resize it any way you want. Um, you can switch the blocks, add in some more elements. It's pretty straightforward. You just need to choose the uh, element, drag it into the uh, page or into the editor and customize it any way you like. All right, so once you're done with the project or once you're satisfied with the website page, you can save it within the tool or if you plan to work on it again um, or go back to it, you can save it in the tool. If you would like to preview the page, you can click preview design. This is, by the way, also mobile optimized. You also have the option to export the file um, you can export it for your WordPress or you can export it via zip file that you can upload in your server. All right. And at the same time, if you need customer support or need help, if you get stuck in any way or while doing a project, you can click on help and click on contact support. And also training videos are available under help as well. All right. And also at the start of the video, I had mentioned that aside from using the pre-built templates you can also choose to create a website page from scratch so from here all you need to do is to click on empty project and it should take you to the editor page where it's basically a blank canvas and you um you need to select the elements and um, the design and drag it to the editor All right, so all you need to do is to just um, continue to build your page by choosing from the uh, elements that are available. And customize them any way that you like. And uh, once you are satisfied with the page, again, you can save it on the tool or you can export it um, or you can export it for your WordPress site or as a zip file to upload in your server. All right, so it's again, the tool is very easy to use. It's just drag and drop. It has a huge selection of pre built templates that you can use. And at the same time, it is packed with hundreds of different elements that you can add in. It has different designs. It's, it's easy for those uh, who are just starting to build pages or again, for those who would like to save on designer costs. All right, so that's it about Page Builder Pro. Thanks for listening.